Whenever I visit a new art museum, I'm always curious to see what specific painting will grab my attention, or will grab the attention of my husband. Often, it's the same piece that strikes us both. And this is what happened at a recent visit to the Ackland Art Museum in Chapel Hill, North Carolina. As soon as we saw this painting by Solomon van Roysdale, we stopped. We spent the next five to ten minutes just admiring it, looking at the brushwork, standing back, getting close. I don't know what it was about it. Maybe it was the composition, or maybe the serenity of the color palette, or maybe the placement and the contrast of his values, or maybe it was all of that. Solomon van Roysdael was one of the leading landscape painters of the early Dutch Golden Age and helped establish the characteristic tonal look of landscapes from that period. He painted at a time when the Netherlands had just won independence from Spain and began to come into their own as a nation. This meant expanding their economic independence through merchandising, and painting became an important part of that. This painting follows certain compositional trends that were popular at that time. The effect was powerful. There's often a low horizon line. There's usually a broad area of sky where the clouds lead the eye to the focal point. Very often you'll see a dark, dramatic foreground and some element of urban life, whether a town, a port, or boats. There are humans, but they're integrated with nature. I love these scenes, and I think he in particular communicates something special in his work. It could have to do with the fact that he preferred to paint from direct observation. One thing that struck me as I researched Roysdale was the excellent condition of so many of his paintings. You hardly see any cracking or paint issues. Now that could be because he worked on board and panel, which helps, but I'm curious to look deeper into his process. Solomon and his colleagues would have a major impact on the next generation of Dutch artists. To include Jacob van Roysdael, considered one of the most important painters in the Dutch Golden Age, and Solomon's nephew, 